Get digging horse today. No. Yeah, horse. Look at my horse. My horse is amazing. Ah, whore means that like a prostitute, like a fucking fuck. Yes, and today we're gonna watch one video called Bilber Epidemic of Gold Digging Horse. And uh, I'm a Russian man who learns English through my own experiences, like books, uh, comedies, Elsa stand ups, uh, different movies, music, and, and other things. I'm native Russian and uh, I started learning English uh, one year ago, and uh, I'm continuing my journey right now. Let's do this uh, together, and uh, we can do this by this build Bureau epidemic of gold digging horse video. Maybe I will understand, maybe not, but let's try to comprehend it in our minds. Yes, we can do this. I'm afraid to get married, man. Why would, why wouldn't, as, why man wouldn't be afraid to get married at this point? You know, look at Kobe, look at the shit he's going through right now. All right, the guy's getting a divorce. His wife's gonna get 70 million bucks. Never hit a layup in her life, you know? Yes, divorce between one person whose name was Kobe. Who is Kobe? Need to Google it. One moment. Kobe. Who is Klobodan Vel Velikovic Kobe? Serbian rapper. Okay. Okay, I learned it. Okay, maybe it is he. It is he, maybe not. Can anybody explain? These divorce settlements, can anybody make sense of these fucking things? Tiger Woods' wife, $250 million! She's a babysitter! Worth a quarter of a billion fucking dollars! He's speaking again about uh, motherhood, about uh, feminine things, about uh, different types of, uh, like, uh, you are a girl and you are nobody, our job is good. Uh, of a man job. Man job is the higher, <laughs> higher class job, like a Nazi of uh, sexual harassment level. Somebody, go ahead, somebody, explain, justify it, justify it. What, what, he cheated on her? I don't give a fuck. Yeah, I don't give a fuck, he cheated on her. Great, the relationship's over right then. Kobe cheated, right? Shouldn't that relationship been over right then? Why did she hang around like some jaded cop for three years trying to get her fucking pension, right? Get that 10 years in? <laughs> I don't know, maybe that's too harsh. Too harsh? That shit bothers me, man. Dude, there is an epidemic of gold digging whores in this country. <laughs> and every night... Uh, they are laughing because of epidemic of gold digging whores. It is like an epidemic, if I will say epidemic of... Uh... <laughs> Jesus. In St. Petersburg, we have epidemic of drunk yards uh, on uh, Sunday and Saturday mornings. Today I was uh, running at uh, 4.30 a.m. 5, okay, 5 a.m. And I was uh, looking at uh, some drunk yards. And it is epidemic of uh, vodka digging drunk yards. And I put on the news and I'm waiting for someone to address it. Every night, never see it, you know? And every night I bring up gold digging whores and the whole crowd pulls back like I'm up here talking about Bigfoot, right? What is Bigfoot? Talking about Bigfoot. What is Bigfoot? Okay, Bigfoot. Bigfoot is game. Bigfoot is North America folklore. Bigfoot or Sasquatch are said to be hairy, upright, walking ape-like creature. Wow. Okay. It is like King Kong. King Kong without death. Like I'm saying the moon's made out of cheese or something. <laughs> Talking about whores, people. They're everywhere. How many? How many more great men are going to get chopped in half before we do something? Arnold Schwarzenegger. Why is it so quiet in here? <laughs> God damn, I don't get it. What is it? Is it women? Do you think I'm calling you? A, I'm not calling any woman here a whore, okay? 
<laughs> so don't pull back. That, that's not fair, okay? If you brought up wife beaters, I wouldn't, I wouldn't like pull back. I get it. These guys hitting women, they need to be stopped. We gotta understand that- These guys hitting women, they need to be stopped. Gold digging whores are the wife beaters for men. <laughs> yeah, they are, except we don't have that Rihanna lumped up photo in the end. So it's not us. Rihanna lumped up photo means that uh, she has, uh, she has punched by his uh, wife. Rihanna violence. One moment. Chris Brown details Rihanna assault. Oh, Jesus Christ. Rihanna beat up. Really? Violence from husband. Yeah, really. Chris Brown reveals the truth about... Wow. About... Uh, the night he assaulted Rihanna and admits she was spitting blood. Oh my Jesus Christ. My Russian Jesus Christ. Okay. Obvious. It's in the eyes. It's in the lines in your face. It's in Mel Gibson's high pitched voice on the answering machine. I had to give up my Laker tickets, right? Who is Mel Gibson? Is Mel Gibson from uh, Simpsons? Corresponder? That is the sound of a man being taken for everything he's got. <laughs> I gotta tell you, sis, I'm envious of women, okay? I'm not saying your problems get solved, but at least they're taken seriously. <laughs> you know? People, you got 1-800 numbers, you, get, you, got, you got ribbons, there's groups. People give a shit. Anything happens to a guy, it's just considered funny. <laughs> Some woman cut her husband's dick off, threw it in the garbage disposal, and turned it on. People thought it was hilarious. They were like, hey, hey, Stumpy, nobody cares. <laughs> you think if a guy removed a woman's titty and threw it in the dryer, anybody would be joking about it the next day? Threw in the dryer, Teddy and threw it in the dryer. Teddy means... Uh... Teddy Bear? The entire country would grind to a halt. There'd be a moment of silence. The NFL would have some special colored headband everybody had to wear for an entire month. The mo halt. There'd be a moment of silence. The NFL would have some special colored headband everybody had to wear for an entire month. I didn't understand it. An NFL, it is maybe National Football League. And... Uh... This band, uh, it is like a fan, fan band or what is it? The most effeminate color they could possibly come up with. All my heroes are going down. Arnold Schwarzenegger, another great man. Another oh, I great remember man. this. Taken down by that gold digging whore of a maid he's got. And I'm not, I'm not saying he's not a piece of shit for doing what he did. It was a piece of shit move. But how come only he got chastised? What about the maid? Why was she called the maid the, that entire story? She was never called a whore, ever. <laughs> Just boggled my... I watched this uh, stand-up, by the way, this episode. Mine. She knew his wife, first name basis, played with their kids, fucked her husband in their own goddamn bed. That's right down the checklist. First ballot Hall of Fame whore. Right there. <laughs> never. Why do you think she hooked up with him? Because of that 1987 flat top he's still rocking? The giant space between his teeth, I could put this mic cord through? Or do you think maybe it's all that kindergarten cop money laying around the goddamn bedroom? No, it's awful. It's a horrific thing to see as a guy, watching guys go through that shit, you know? And then there's no, there's no sort of examination of it. They just go, ah, he's an idiot. Hey, stupid. That guy's stupid. If that guy's stupid, what the fuck am I? Right? <laughs> Does it even make sense? Why would you do that? Why would you accomplish all that and then fuck it up? Hooking up with one of the ugliest human beings I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Not saying I'm a prize, I'm just saying, you know? It's gotta be something beyond that, right? You know what I think it is? I think it comes down to the way he talks. You know? <laughs> 
That dude should be unloading trucks in Transylvania. <laughs> that, should be, that should have been the height of his success. But because he's a great man, he had the balls to move to America. Became famous for lifting weights. I lift weights, nobody gives a shit. <laughs> he lifts weights, ah, 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 becomes super famous. Did he rest on his laurels? No, next challenge. I'm gonna become an actor, despite the fact that nobody can really understand me. <laughs> Against all odds, he starts making movies. Get down, there's a bomb, get out of there. <laughs> Becomes one of the biggest blockbuster stars of all time. What are you gonna do next, Arnie? I think I'm Maddie Kennedy. There's no fucking way you can do that. Bam, he does it. Cherry on top, I'm running for governor of a state I can't even pronounce, and he wins the election. Why wouldn't this, this guy was, think he couldn't... Th this was, was the most loudest joke in this uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger speech. Bang is made in his own bed and get away with it. This dude has been in the zone for over four decades. Four decades, nothing but net. Bang a maid in my own bed, dude. That's a layup. Are you serious? What is layup, by the way? Layup it is uh, specific in fitness club thing. Layup, a one-handed shot made from near the basket, especially one or a bounce or the big board. One moment, uh, as the state of action or something, especially a sheep being laid up. One moment, need to Google images. Is it from basketball? I had a hit movie with the midget. I don't even need a condom. <laughs> right? And then what happens? The smoke clears. Then all these trolls come out of the woodwork and start judging this great man. All these fatties, these fucking old guys who never got any with their jowls coming on TV, absolutely reprehensible behavior. <laughs> what kind of a public servant? His, his, his legacy is shrouded. <laughs> like they have any idea what it's like to be tempted at that level, right? Like they have groupies as they waddle out to their mercury tracer, <laughs> parked on the other side of a dumpster. Really, you're beating them off? This guy, he's not a great man anymore. Terminator doesn't count. Is that what the fuck you're telling me? Because he fucked Alice, really? He's still not a great man because he did that. Then that's, the whole thing's over. Anybody here think they could move to Austria, learn the language, become famous for working out, then be a movie star, then marry into their royalty and hold public office? How many lifetimes would you need? I'm on my third attempt at Rosetta Stone Spanish. All right? How can I judge these guys? I can barely handle the temptations of Facebook. I'm gonna judge Tiger Woods. Who is Tiger Woods, by the way? Tiger Woods. Tiger Woods. Eldred Tom Tiger Woods is an American professional golfer. He ranked second all time in both men's major championship in, and PGA Tour. Wins and also holds numerous golf records. Hmm. Black guy. Uncle Tom. I golf, I don't walk off the 18th hole and there's a busload of Scandinavian women waiting to fuck my brains out. This part I didn't, I didn't uh, watch. Oh, sorry ladies, gotta go home to the wife, right? <laughs> no, it kills me. And there's no help out there for guys. There isn't. There's nothing out there to help you handle becoming rich and famous. There's nothing to prepare you for that, for that platoon of whores that's gonna form on the... Platoon on a horse. Platoon. What is it? Is uh, like a big amount or what? Platoon. Platoon. It is film. What is platoon? Platoon maybe mini. Okay, mini. Platoon t -t 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 company soldiers usually form in a tactical unit that is commanded by a sub turn of latent and divided into three sections. Ah, it is unit of military. Okay. Horizon, right? Like Braveheart, faces painted, skirts on, will run down the hill, they'll jump on your dick in front of your wife. They don't give a shit. It's not even a handbook out there. 
I saw one article written about it on, time, on the cover of Time magazine. It said, why do so many rich, famous, and powerful men act like absolute pigs, right? And the article was actually written by a woman. <laughs> That's like me writing a book, the third trimester, and what to expect. <laughs> okay, one moment, need to listen it again. Absolute pigs, right? And the article was actually written by a woman. That's like me writing a book, the third trimester, and Trimester? And what to expect. The third trimester. Trimester. Who is it? Trimester. A period of three months, especially as a division of the duration of pregnancy. That's like me writing a book, the third trimester, and what to expect. <laughs> I understood it. It's like a, about pregnancy that uh, finally will be uh... <laughs> ah no he he talks he he was talking about pregnancy and he's comparing two facts about men that uh, about women who wrote book about man and about him who could write book about pregnancy because uh, girl woman don't know doesn't know nothing almost nothing about man because she's woman and uh, the same situation like uh, he doesn't know anything about pregnancy because uh, she he he did he didn't experience it and uh, it is good comparing ladies you're gonna feel a pressure how the hell would i know you don't want to hear that from me right then why is this woman telling me what it's like to have a dick that makes no sense you have no idea what it's like to have a dick. 24-7. Do it, do it. Fuck it, do it. That's what it's saying. Do it, do it. Yeah, do it. It is like Shia LaBeouf. That's how we survived as a species. Every man in here is programmed to fuck 85% of the women in this room. Right? Yeah, we are. Do it, do it. Fuck it, do it. You know? It's just that you won't. That's the only reason why we don't. You know? That's not you keeping your dick in check. You know? Some guy at, at Home Depot working there, he wants to fuck just as many women as a celebrity, right? But he, he can't do it because whores don't care about lumber, right? Don't care about lumber. What is lumber? Lumber, is it a specific disease or what is? Lumber. Burden someone with an unwanted responsibility task or set of circumstances. Timber sewn into roof. Moving the slow. One moment. Tumber. Tumber. What? Lum. Lum. Lumber. Lumber. Okay. Lumber. Lumber, it is specific material. Maybe you have slang. Lumber, meaning. Moving is slow, heavy. Okay. Slow, heavy, awkward way. Okay, let's listen again. Check. You know, some guy at, at Home Depot working there, he wants to fuck just as many women as a celebrity, right? But he, he can't do it because whores don't care about lumber, right? Whores don't care about lumber. Ah, means that he's like a lumber. Lumber that he's uh, not good man. He's uh, unuseful. Yes. <laughs> but the second he hits the fucking lottery. But the second he. All of a sudden, you know that do it, do it, fuck it, do it. You know that wasn't affecting his life. Then all of a sudden, these horse show up. I'll do it. I'll suck it. I'll do it. Right. <laughs> no, somebody's got, somebody's got to step up. All right. I'm not even blaming horse, really. It's just guys will fucking do it, do it, fucking do it. The idiots. What are we doing? Why are we working so hard and then giving it all away to some chick who did three shifts at a, at a fucking Hooters, you know? 
To some chick who did three shifts at a, at a fucking Hooters. Who did three shifts at the fucking Hooters? What is Hooters? Hooters. It is about uh, cheerleading. You know, they're fucking bums sitting there with fucking Dorito dust in their cleavage, walking around with hundreds of millions of dollars. I'm sick of that shit. That's what the law says. hundred years ago, I could beat you with a fucking mop handle. I'd be like, well, that's what the law says. Doesn't make us right. He's funny. No, it's unreal. And all this shit's going down, and we don't, we, we're not doing anything. What are we doing? Same old shit. Sitting around watching Shark Week, right? What is Shark Week? Shark Week. Shark Week, it is shark-based programming. TV program. Discovery, Shark Week. Maybe I watched it. Maybe not. <laughs> Fucking Shark Week, okay. <laughs> Watching shit about poisonous snakes half a world away, just filling your head up with all this useless information. What to do if you come face to face with a Bengal tiger? Don't look at it, don't look away. Slowly back up as you push your friend forward, right? As you push your friend. Ah, it means that you, if uh, you have a friend, you should push your friend forward. All this useless information, yet hanging between your legs is this thing that could crumble your entire empire seven minutes or less. Don't know a fucking thing about it. Even worse, you think it's your friend. Yeah, you know why? Because your dick, your dick's like a dreamer, you know? Your dick believes. It's like a motivational speaker. <laughs> I don't give a shit what question you ask it. It's always like, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Sounds like a plan. Exit strategy. Later. We'll be fine. <laughs> Where's your dick when you get caught, right? Then it's just slumped over like, hey, I thought it was a good idea. You know? Yeah. You have to know that. Dude, your if your dick was a third base coach, it wouldn't hold anybody up. It'd just be fucking waving people around. Everybody, go in standing up. You got it. You got it. Oh, shit. Nice. I, slide, I, want, slide, slide, slide. I want to listen yeah, to this again. Yeah, you know why? Because your dick, your dick's like a dreamer. You know? Your dick believes. It's like a motivational speaker. I don't give a shit what question you ask it. It's always like, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Sounds like a plan. Exit strategy. Later. We'll be fine. Where's your dick when you get caught, right? Then it's just slumped over like, hey, I thought it was a good idea. You, know? yeah. you have to know that. Dude, your if your dick was a third base coach, it wouldn't hold anybody up. It'd just be fucking waving people around. Everybody, go in standing up. You got it, you got it. Oh shit, here she comes. Slide, slide, slide. All right, you guys were awesome. Thank you so much for coming out. Really nice. I hope you had as good a time as I did. Thank you. Finally, about dick and about do it, do it, fucking do it. Uh, it is so uh, funny. Another things uh, from uh, this, from this stand up about Arnie was uh, laughing to, but I laughed yesterday because I watched it yesterday. Yes, whole stand up is good. Whole about horse, <laughs> not horse. And I learned uh, some words like a uh, Kobe, Slobodan Kobe, Serbian rapper, Elsa, Bigfoot. I didn't know before about Bigfoot. Elsa Hooters. It is uh, our player team. It is uh, specific uh, girls uh, like uh, cheerleaders. Elsa Tiger Woods, uh, this American professional golfer, Platoon from military and Shark Week. It is television show. It is new vocabulary that I learned from it and also I improved my comprehensional skills by listening and watching it subtitles sometimes and uh, listening. The more you listen, the more you comprehend. And also I want to say first story was about uh, that uh, our world is uh, fulfilled by epidemic of uh, sucking, digging horse uh, of gold. And uh, next step was about Arnie and next was about uh, Tiger Woods uh, that I didn't understand. And the last and finally was about uh, dig and uh, part about digs uh, that they are like motivational speakers and they are like <laughs> couch third based third based what is third 
base couch couch let's let's google it who is it additionally the third base couch is responsible for advising ah i didn't know it before i i thought that couch is like a not couch potato couch like a person who coach do you know coaching online like a motivation but here the f it is runner he must know the speed of each runner the location of the battle ball it is is it uh, is it person who always uh, supports somebody on uh, on baseball yes okay i learned it too Thanks so much for whole watching this series. It is so it was interesting. Bill Burr is good, is good. I like him, and uh, we will continue our journey of learning English. For me, it is new vocabulary. For you, it is maybe some fun, maybe th some thoughts, maybe research work because you didn't know before how Russian reacts on some kind of some kind of these tools and videos and. Uh, you maybe didn't know before about how uh, how does a Russian man without good English reacts on it only with truthful reaction really truthful because uh, I should think about it it is a uh, really big job for me okay thanks so much for watching see you next time sincerely kissing you and have a nice day